initial members of the uh, steering committee. Where are the facts published? Here? Louder! But if there are new members. I don't hear anything in the back! <laughs> I've, I've seen the list that Kathy was gracious enough to supply with tennis. The charter said it's supposed to be seven or nine. There are a lot more than seven or nine. There are a lot more than seven or nine on that list, and we don't know who they are. And I'm not aware, except in the case of Mike Kent, where the process was very dutifully observed. He was confirmed, I believe, in 2010. I'm not aware of anyone else being confirmed by the community council. <coughs> because this process of confirmation is what allows us, as a community, to participate and have a voice in who gets to claim that they speak for the community council and for the community. That's why I think it's very important to make a good faith effort to observe this contract to the letter as best you can. Okay, so we should probably move on to the agenda item. Yeah, let's go ahead and move on to 